All right, guys. So what's going on? Back with more Paper Mario: Thousand Year Door. Uh, I think there's a shine sprite here that I have not collected because if you noticed, uh, if you noticed, I've never fully upgraded uh, Miss Mouse, who's only at rank one, one uh, shine sprite. So I'm missing another move. Move. I know what move it is, but. We'll just keep that a secret for now. But I, there's supposed to be a shine sprite right here, I think. Because it says something about behind a big rock. I'm thinking this is it. But I could be wrong. This ain't right? What? Oh, there it was. Okay. Well, all right. So I'm gonna find the other shine sprite, and uh, yeah, just hang on, guys. All right. So this is the final spot, at least for me, where uh, I get all these shine sprites. For my partner, so yeah, this is the spot where they say it's the spikes and the little ways. Now you have to get some kind of switch or whatever to get uh, the uh, shine sprite here. So uh, yeah, we'll see what happens. So I think last time I came here, I couldn't finish it. So yeah. Oh what? Hello. Wow. Uh, okay, so this is where, yeah, the super boots, and you couldn't get them because you needed the ultra boots. That is so weird. Uh, well, guys, this uh, concludes the last part. Part of, um, I mean, not the last part. This concludes me having all shine sprites, so. Yeah, uh, you have to have the ultra boots to get these, so. And there you go. I have all shine sprites and that's it all right so now I am going to swap over to me at the uh, troubles board so yeah Alright, so I'm here at Rogueport, and uh, I'm going to just, just show you guys that um, I'm going to be able to level up this mouse since I found the uh, last two uh, science rights. So here we go, this mouse. So I power this partner? Yes. Guys, I will tell you one thing, since we partner up all powers, please never rely on Shed Ripple. That guy is a ripoff, for sure. So there's something here somewhere. Seriously, I need to go to the trouble board and... <laughs> I need to go to the trouble board and just go ahead and start those up because I am wasting time here. Oh, look at that. They still, you see, they still got the little panel thing. There we go. Yeah. All right. Wait a minute. Sorry, guys. I have to check. I just have to. Oh lord, look at the flame. The frame drops just drop crazy. Not half, but enough where it's noticeable. Alright. Now we're. Look at that. Now we're gonna go ahead and go to the job board. 
trouble board. Job board. Alright. So last time we did, we finished with these three. And now we're going to do three more. Oh, you know, I think that's it. Look at that. Oh, I did right by doing three at a time. Okay, Gold Bob, delivery, please. I need you to take something to General White. White, please come get it with all speed. Oh, no. Guys, I got a feeling we're going to have to do that thing again with General White where he's kept swapping from place to place. Will you just stay at home, man, if you're not there? <laughs> Meet me in Post the Heights. Want to take on Gold Bob's trouble? Yes. Do it and do it right. No. S-H-I-T. All right. Well, guys, I'll see you in Post the Heights to see Gold Bob. So, Gonzalez, how did you enjoy your cannon run? Hmm? I'd like to go to the moon and look for some investment opportunities. But enough of that. I need you to take this to General White immediately. You got a package. An item gold Bob asked you to deliver to General White. I think General White is back in far out of place now. It's a bit far, but you can handle it. Of course, but, uh... Gold Bob, I don't think you know this, but uh, the last time I had to find General White, he was going place to place to place, and it just might happen again. Now, I'm not sure if I actually put that in the video this time, but guys, let's see if General White isn't for an outpost this time without me having to go on place to place, which I feel like he's not, but um, yeah, I'll see you there. All right, so we're in Far Outpost, and I guarantee you General White is not here. Oh, man, I'm telling you. All right, so let's talk to the mayor. Cannon will not be fired until the day we have been waiting for comms. Okay. Well, that doesn't explain to me where General White is, but all right, sir. Seems to be locked. Oh, man. Oh, oh boy. General, where is okay? This is supposed to be General White's cabin. Uh, okay. Oh my goodness, he's not here, huh? General White, he left this morning. Well, pal, that uh, he uh, said he was going to see Cola Bartender in Roadport or something. Oh boy, what I tell you guys? What did I tell you? Oh, boy, they sure do never make things easy for you, do they? Let's go. Okay, Flavio. But uh, let's go ahead and ask Podley. General White, yeah, I spoke to him just a second ago, actually. We're old buddies, he and I. I've known him since he was a little snapper that would explode over any little thing. Then again, I was kind of... Was kind of guy that would bonk people for smiling funny. Still, he turned out to be a fine bob op, though he never cured, cured that wanderlust. I'm pretty sure he said he was off to Glitzville next. Uh, I go back pretty far with the guy that runs the juice shop there too. So give him my best. Well, here we go again. All right, I guarantee you he's gonna be gone. I I don't know how long this is gonna take, but. I'm just going to keep transitioning throughout every time that uh, I can't find him until he finally gets back to Far Outpost. So, uh, yeah. Just post video game stuff. It's crazy. Man, this toad right here, dude, she is just so gorgeous. Like, my goodness. 
And she, she, I'm talking about she looks completely different than all the other toes, even the female toes. Like, seriously. Like, she's the only toad I know that has, like, blonde hair. You know, it could, you know, it could be, uh, no, I'm just joking. Can't be her because she has pink pigtails. I was going to say she could be a toadette in disguise or something. So, uh, yeah. Well, let's talk to this guy that looks just like Potley. Colonel White, he pounded three white chocolate coconut mochas and bolted. He drops in every once in a while. Hey, and you know that lady in the black dress? I think General White has a thing for her, but that's just my gut talking there. She's darn cute, after all. Guys come in more for her than for the juice, I think. Hey, and just between you and me, one of her admirers is Rock Hawk. Oh, and now that I think of it, General White said he was going to Far Outpost soon. But first he had to meet Gold Bob, or not meet him, or something like that. Alright, so, let's talk to this lady real quick. Welcome back, it's Oz. Everyone's been all a, t a Twitter waiting for your return. We've all missed your fabulous moves. Alright then. Well, I'll be back to destroy Glitch Pit. Well, I think this is about a beep. <laughs> but yeah, um, I cannot find General White. He is not here. Or should I say, General White is not here. Hmm, should I check inside this man's house? General White, nowhere to be found. Not even a single winder. As you can see, they got the little wind-up thing on there. Uh, <clears throat> Gonzalez, General White was just here a moment ago. But you had the thing I wanted to give him. What a rotten bit of luck. He said he was headed back to Far Outpost. That General White is a fine bomb, but he does tend to wander. And once he's asleep, it's near impossible to wake him. Don't you know? I told him to stay out they out and awake so get over too far outpost sorry about that well alright guys <laughs> transitioning back and far outpost man this is ridiculous I tell you alright we're back at far outpost again now let's see if he's here or what am I talking about he is supposed to be here he's gone back to sleep damn it Oh boy. <laughs> For real. He seems to be asleep. Wake him up. He's still asleep. Try again. He's still sound asleep. Try again. He's definitely still asleep. This <laughs> is ridiculous. He might as well just put us up in a freaking uh, boss battle or something like that. While he's just like asleep on the other side, and then when he wakes up, <laughs> damn, the battle ends. Like, come on. Ugh. Hut, hello, Mario. Do you need something? Hut, what? A delivery from Gold Bob? You came all that way to bring it to me? Well, thank you for that. I'll take it off your hands. Ah, uh, yes. Well delivered. So you'll go fetch a reward, I assume. Say hello to Gold Bob when you see him. Well then, perhaps I'll go check on my cannon. Uh... What? He wakes up and says he's going to check out a cannon. And that just woke him up. Come on, man. What is this business? Oh, my goodness. Sorry, I had to check and see, and there it goes. Now I gotta check where all star pieces are, because I think you can uh, collect enough star pieces to buy 
uh, bad just from the guy. But anyways, guys, I'll see you uh, back in Postley Heights with Gold Bob. All right, sir. I am here to collect my payment. Did you find General White? I see, and he received it. Good. Thanks, Gonzalez. Here is your reward. 64 coins. Yeah. All right. Well, guys, back to the uh, trouble board and road port. All right. Here we are back at the trouble board. So, at the gold box. Man, for just one trouble, that was a long one. Hope. Wow. Excuse me about that. Hopefully, uh, when I edit this in the uh, Adobe, that it's at least 10 minutes or less. Uh, gob, I can't speak. All right. I've lost my voice because of this stupid stuffy coat. Just boomski. <laughs> I want someone to bring me some honey candy. You pow. Great for the throat I hear. I think you make it by combining honey, honey, uh, cake, well, I'm about to say honey mix, cake mix and honey syrup, Ch your child, I'll be waiting next, I'll be waiting next to the snowman in far outpost, your blammo, oh boy, uh, we gotta go right back to far outpost just after doing that, wow, alright guys, we're gonna get us some honey syrup and some cake mix, but, um, I gotta store some of my items, though, so, what we're gonna do here, ooh, another Luigi book, oh, damn, 256 coins, no, sorry, brother, gotta get that another time, store, store, don't need the hot sauce right now, I, I'm not sure, I think hot sauce boosts your attack, I'm not quite sure, I thought I read it somewhere, but I could be wrong about that, make sure you guys check me on that, so, that I know what it actually does. Or I could just easily Google it. But just let me know if I'm right or wrong. Let's see what else we're gonna store. Ooh, you know I don't really need any of this right now. Couples cake. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and put that up. And no, uh, but I will like to withdraw. Let's see, do I have any honey? Syrup. No, I don't. No honey syrup. I got plenty of Reuben powder. That's nice. All right. Ooh, you know I need to take. I need to take me a good nap. Nap because look at my HP and stuff. Pretty damn low. Ah, uh, and cake mix. I got enough coins to buy some from the uh, gaming parlor. Why don't they just, or Piazza Parlor, if you would, why don't they just um, sell it somewhere? But uh, I guess it's rare, so they're not going to do that. Okay, I'll prepare the minigame to play part the tube game and the boat game. Uh, yeah, so I pretty much traded uh, everything in. Alright, let's try, let's try a look at this. Oh boy. That's cool. Forget it. I'm not gonna be wasting time on that. So let me go ahead and get my cake mix. Trade in winnings. Oh wow, cake mix is only six piantas. Yes. Nope, we're good. Lady, you still hanging out at the gang corner? Go see your kids and your husband. Alright guys, uh let me get this uh, honey candy together. 
right now. And uh, after Zest he prepares there, I'm going to transition to Far Outpost to the guy. Yes, and. Yes. Oh, dang, that restores enough of uh, FP. It's just like a heart from Kate, but it looks cooler. Well, alright, guys, um, I'll see you for our outpost. Alright, uh, I think it's this guy way over here next to. No, actually, I think it's him. Yeah, I got it right. Okay, couldn't understand anything he said. Ah, finally I can speak. I had been exploding so much that I completely lost voice. Thanks. Here is a token of my appreciation. 20 coins, cool. Alright, man. That takes care of that. Uh, I'll see you guys back at the job. Wow, I keep saying job board. <laughs> the trouble board uh, at Rogueport. Alright guys, we are back at the trouble board. There we go, see I got it right in time. Who's our... Okay, Todia. I want to meet Luigi. I must meet my darling Luigi. Come to the fountain in Poshley Heights for details. Okay, want to take on Todia's trouble? Yes. Ah, so you know what that means. <laughs> ah. The hell? See how that guy was walking before we come here? Anyways, uh, there's this... Okay, hello. So you accepted my request for trouble, I hope. I thought maybe I'd be Luigi. It'd be Luigi. Oh well, so could you bring him here, maybe? I'm a huge, huge fan of his. I just have to meet him, and I want to give him a cake. I have to give him a cake. Okay, bring Luigi here. Got it? Well, tip, uh, technically, guys, you're not supposed to uh, get Luigi as uh, we have this L emblem badge which turns us into Luigi. So, uh, uh, I don't know whether to go talk to Luigi or not, but no, nah, that would be silly because I already know this trouble that you're not actually supposed to go get him because if you, he'll just talk about the same thing about his stories. So it's like, what do you do? Well,. So make sure you've got a Luigi badge and just go down and equip it. Now you know I've always thought about something. That why did you get the uh, Wild Luigi out costume when you click both of these? See, because W means Wario and L means Luigi. So you know how like they made Wild Luigi, they uh, put Wario and Luigi's name together. Yeah, but he's supposed to be an anti-Luigi. So the W Y and L Luigi. So putting those two together just makes Wild Luigi. So that completely makes sense uh, the way I think about it. This uh, yeah, Luigi emblem, and there we go. Eek! I can tell. I can totally tell. I've never met him before, but I can absolutely tell. You're the real Luigi. <laughs> That's what she thinks. Ha ha ha. Ah, I knew it. This is so cool. Oh my gosh, what should I say? Ah, I totally freaking him out. I'm freaking out, Luigi. Oh no, what should I do? Oh, right. Da 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 da. The cake. The one I picked was a total loss, but Zest T did a great job on this one. Here you go, Mr. Luigi. Please take this. You got a chocolate cake. 
The cake made by Zesty replenishes 5 HP and 15 FP. Look at the Ouija. Hey, bro, say, why are you dressed like me? Hey, who, who do you think you are? You feel the imposter? Police! What? I'm no imposter, I'm Luigi. Hey, say something, Mario? <laughs> Dude, Mario is cold. That's why Luigi's always shadowed by him, man. Like, Mario's like, eh? He know that's his brother. Look, Mario ain't even gonna back him up with this. Eee! Ew, ew, ew! He's so much like Luigi. It's creepy. He's trying to masquerade as Luigi to interrupt our special time together. Th that's crazy. This is a nightmare. A bad dream. I won't believe it. Wake up! He took off running. Man, Mario, that's cold. You should have said something. Ah, no way. I know I was supposed to see that. No way. Uh, actually, yes, you were. Don't, don't worry about it. Oh, thanks. Really, Luigi. You're so sweet. And thanks for coming today. I will always treasure these moments. Always. So please, come see me again, okay? You solved the trouble. Boy, boy, I tell you, Mario's cold. Oh, wow, you came again. Luigi remembers me. Luigi remembers me. <laughs> Boy, that is so cold, man. I don't even know why. Come on, Mario. You see Mario? Mario just... Hmm? Come on, Mario. You're supposed to be a big brother here. Anyways, guys, that is it for Troubles Part. Troubles Part 8. But overall, this is uh, Paper Mario Thousand Year Door video number 82 on my channel. So, yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I'll see you next time in a different video another day. Peace out, Rayquazard Clan.